Back home and to Garissa, three county assembly committee members have demanded that the area governor, Nathif Jama, find a replacement for sacked former finance CEC Ahmed Aden. The MCs from the public investment, public accounts and finance committees said it was wrong for the governor to appoint his deputy Hussein Abdullahi in an acting capacity to such a sensitive office. The MCs further took issue with the closure of the county treasury since the reshuffle that saw the appointment of the deputy governor on an acting capacity. They accused the deputy governor of closing the offices, locking out the staff who are now operating from the corridors. A sport check at the Treasury on Tuesday showed little activity, with the main offices, including that of the county executive, locked. Efforts to reach the deputy governor to comment on the allegations were not successful as his phone was still switched off. Eh, kama ni bedroom yake amenda nazo Nairobi. Kwa hivyo sisi kwa sababu ya mahitaji ya wakazi wa kaunti hii na kama watu ambao wanawakilisha sehemu mbalimbali mbali, na kama ambayo komiti ambayo imepatiwa hiyo jukumu tumaamua leo tukuje kuona na tupeane ripoti kamili kwa assembly. And we want to demand that these offices be opened offer service to the public so that the county government can be able to run efficiently and effectively. It is sad that at this particular point in time the deputy governor who has assumed the role of the CEC for finance is nowhere to be found. Neither has he allowed his juniors and staff to operate in the offices.